All right, what's up, guys? This is Ninja Death Strike bringing you the next Let's Play, and yes, we are going to be playing Pokemon Blue version, and yes, we are going to be Nuzlocking it. So I realized that NBZ just started doing a Nuzlocke of Pokemon Blue, but I don't care. I was already planning to do this, so I'm going to do it too. But without further ado, let's get into it. So uh, for those of you who aren't familiar with what a Nuzlocke is, uh, it's basically Pokemon Hard Mode. And the rules are, every time one of your Pokemon faints, you treat it as though it were dead. You have to put it in a box. You can never, ever use it again. And beyond that, you're only allowed to catch the first Pokemon you see in every, u every route. And you have to nickname everything so that you love them, and when they die, you feel sad. So, figured, uh, I haven't played Pokemon Blue in more than 10 years. Uh, it was my very first Pokemon game, and really feeling nostalgic so I decided I wanted to go back and play through it and this time you guys get to watch along so let's get into it I already skipped over Professor Oak's introduction but that's okay my name is Ninja right so your name is Ninja this is my grandson he's been your rival since you were a baby uh, and he forgets his name, so in classic Pokemon Blue, Pokemon Gen 1 rival nicknames, we're going to name our rival Dix. Can't go wrong with Dix. That's right, I remember now, his name is Dix. Ninja, your very own Pokemon legend is about to unfold. A world of dreams and adventures with Pokemon awaits. Let's go! And just like that, we're off for our next Nuzlocke adventure. So we've got the old school, classic SNES. I actually thought it was a original Nintendo, but I guess it's not. So let's get the potion out of our computer. I have to remember the bag is not compartmentalized at all, so you can only carry like 20 different things, which kind of sucks. All right. Mom learns everything she knows from TV. Let's go check it, Oak's lab. I'm gonna have to resist the urge to just speed run everything. That speed up button is very hazardous for me. Oh, Oak's not here. Dix is though. Okay, I'll have to go find him. I bet he's in the long grass. Don't go out. Every time he says this line, I always remember back to uh, Jurassic Park 2 when they go, they're headed towards the old center, and the one guy's like, Don't go into the long grass. Uh, sorry. Every time I read that line, I read it in that exact voice. So here we go. I'm fed up with the waiting. Three Pokemon here. They're inside of the Pokeballs. When I was young, I was a serious Pokemon trainer. My old age, I only have these three left. Choose one. Okay, so we're gonna start Squirtle because he was my original starter in my very first Pokemon game. Nope, don't want Charmander. There he is, Squirtle, the tiny turtle Pokemon. After birth, its back swells and hardens into a shell. Powerful sprays foam from its mouth. I want the water Pokemon Squirtle. Yes, I do. Ninja receives Squirtle. Yes, I do want to give a nickname to Squirtle. Uh, nicknames. I will be doing the list again. So if you want your name added to the list, please sign up below in the comments. Um, I guess I'll get take around the first 25 people to sign up. That should be plenty for this run, but Squirtle is mine. I'm going to nickname him, and let's see. Um, Neo. I don't know why I decided to name him Neo. Originally, I didn't have a, a nickname on Squirtle, but I'll give him one this time. So we've got Neo the Squirtle against Bulbazar. And here we go. It's on. Bring it, dicks. Do 
Dix wants to fight. Send out Bulbazar. Ah, those glorious Gen 1 sprites. Look at Squirtle. He looks like a creepy old man. Um, I'm gonna go for some tail whips. And hopefully I don't get crit. Okay, I this is good. Growl. I failed! I forgot Growl can miss back in, this, in Gen 1. Everything can miss. Take it, Bulbasaur. Oh, that didn't do anything. Wow. That was after two tail whips. Still not a three hit KO. Oh, speed tie, critical hit! Crap! I might have to use my potion. Oh, return crit. Alright, one more. You got this, Neo. Take him down. Yes! Suck it, dicks. Woo! Level six! That's right, only four stats. There's no such thing as special attack, special defense. They're one, and it is the best stat. And, uh, no natures, no abilities. Nothing like that. Just type. Smell you later, dicks. <laughs> Your dick smells. Uh, oh, that's it. <laughs> Raise your Pokemon by making it fight. Simple and to the point. Alright, so let's heal up at home, and then we'll head up into Viridian City. Obviously, we don't have, uh... Don't have any Pokeballs yet, so... We can't catch anything, but... Can get Neo some more experience. Ah, uh, Route 1 music. How I love it. Give me free potion. Yes. Free potion number two. Okay. Wow, am I not going to run into anything? I love how sharp the uh, picture is on the emulator. I remember the original Game Boy being pretty muddled. Much clearer here. Uh, there we go. First random encounter. Who's it going to be? Ratata. Level 3. Shouldn't be too bad. Yes! Miss! See, Neo's the one. These stat moves have no effect on him. Take down Ratata. There we go. One more battle, I should level up again. Hopefully. Sis, Pidgey. Alright, I'm gonna speed this up. Wow, I got crit. Gotta be careful about those crits in speed up mode. At least Neo's rocking some massive defense. Special's not terrible either. Pokemart? Or Pokemon Center. One floor. <laughs> Trading center is right next to the healing place. No second floor, no basement. That doesn't even look like Nurse Joy. Alright, that's done. Let's hit up the Pokemart. Ninja got Oak's parcel. I will do that. Also, let's go up here and look at the drunk old man. <laughs> you can't go through here. This is private property, so I'm laying in the middle of the road to keep you out. He hasn't had his coffee yet. I've heard in the Japanese version he is drunk and belligerent. I'm not sure if that's true. If anyone can confirm, let me know, but... I love how he's blocking the path by lying in the middle of it. Just refusing to let anybody go through his property. Which is clearly not his property. It's obviously a road. That doesn't stop him though. Alright, another battle. Pidgey. Okay, that one went much better. <laughs> oh wow, super speed. Too fast. Uh oh, level 4. I should be careful here. Oh, and there's Gus now, but it's not doing much. Got it. 
Okay, no more speed up. Okay. Let's heal up again. Man, grinding on these first routes is always precarious. <clears throat> Need to be very careful. Oh, I want to switch tech speed fast. Oh, also, we're going to do shift uh, set battle style for this. Since I'm not doing a ROM hack, I need something to make it a little more difficult. So set battle it is. Let's go ahead and save. I think I can retrieve. I'll probably just do a save state anyhow to be safe, but I think I can retrieve, retrieve the save file as well. But time to get our Pokedex from Professor Oak. Oh, here comes Dix again. Pokedex. I'm not going to do a very good job with that. <laughs> Considering I can only catch one thing each route. The greatest undertaking in Pokemon history. Did you guys get that? Oh, yeah? I'm going to screw your town map. Dicks. Just like I screwed your sister. I know where I'm going. I don't even need it. Okay, Radita. Neo kill. Yes! Level 8. Defense and special. That's nice. That's a nice stat spread. Oh yeah, bubble. Game over. Dix isn't going to know what hit him next time we meet. But I can get Pokeballs, so I'm going to do that now. I'm having a huge nostalgia trip right now. I just want to spend all day on Route 1. I have Picnic. Neo will blow bubbles for me. It'll be great. We'll never leave. No one will ever die. I won't be sad. Because someone's going to die. Gen 1 is... Maybe it's just because I was so much younger when I played it, but it just seems like the hardest gen that do not mess around with the gym battles. Like, Misty Starmie? I have no idea how I'm going to fight that thing. I had to grind to like level 25 to take that on. Antidote's very important since your Pokemon can fate due to poison. Perilous heal. Let's get... Actually, we should probably buy some more. Let's get three. Burn heal, not going to be as important. We'll go ahead and get two, just in case. I don't even think anything burns. Except, like, the odd fire move. There's no Will-O-Wisp yet. But anyhow, we let's go catch something. So who's it going to be, Pidgey or Rattata? Now, I do already have uh, Robotnik is Sexy, as I was guest narrating on his Nuzlocke. I mentioned I was doing this, and he requested to be my first catch, so... Whoever is here is going to be good old Robotnik. If I ever find anything, fingers crossed for Pidgey, guys. Pidgey, Pidgey, Pidgey. Yes, Pidgey. Sweet. All right. Although it's probably inevitable that I end up with a Rattata at some point. Um, one more should do it. Please don't crit. And it's level 4, too. That's nice. That'll save me some time grinding him up. Item. Pokeball. Alright. Get in my ball. One, two, three. Yes! Wow, it, it only shook twice and then it stayed there. Anyhow, I caught him. Tiny Bird. A common sight in forest and woods. It flaps its wings at ground level to kick up blinding sand. Yes, yeah, sand attack. We all... Uh, know how fun that is. So, let's see. Uh, nickname. Ro... Botnik should fit. Ro... But, I'm just gonna call him Robosex. Or Robotnik Sex? Will that fit? 
Oh, it will fit. That's that's gonna be his name then. S E X Robot X X. Awesome. So let's go heal him up. Oh wow, that was real fast. Heal. Pokemon are fighting fit. We hope to see you again. Okay, um, I'm gonna pause while I grind up. I'll be right back. All right, back. Uh, and we've got both of them grinded up, so no mishaps grinding, thank God. Let's take a look at our guys, both at level 10. So we've got Neo, 16, 20, 17, 17. That's pretty, uh, pretty all around nice stat spread, which is really nice for Nuzlocke. Definitely liking that big defense. And then uh, next up, got Robotnik X. 17, 16, 17, 14. Not as great. He's fast, though. I like that. Um, hopefully he'll survive. He's doing okay so far. But I'm going to go ahead and end the episode a little bit early just because I don't want to catch anything else without the names list. So I can actually hit up a couple of other routes around here and get some party members pretty quick. But I want to wait till I have the list. So I will end it for here. Uh-huh. Now you've had your coffee. Oh, wait, we're going to watch this guy show us how to catch Radita. Um, anyhow, yeah, add your name to the list. I will have the next episode coming shortly. And, um, yeah, comment, rate, sub, all that great stuff. I can't wait to see where this goes. So uh, we're going to watch this old man with his 50 Pokeballs catch a Weedle and enable missing no mode for later. We're not going to do that right now, though. All right, that's it. Later, guys.